I'm so excited to be here today. We're gonna do a little project. And everybody has pencils on their desk, right? Okay. So we're gonna pass out paper. You're going to draw a picture of a scientist. What's your scientist holding? A magnifying glass. When I think of a scientist, I think of an old man. An old man? I do a fat, short man. Oh, a fat, short man? Yeah. Tell me about your scientist. He's smart. She's smart. She's young. She's young. Is it a boy or a girl? Girl. Why'd you do that? Because I'm not sure if there's too many girl scientists out there. Because it used to be like boy, just boys, and then... And did you draw a boy or a girl? Um, boy. They're all boys. Why is that? Hmm. I don't know why I didn't draw any girls. Girl scientist? I drew a young girl scientist. I drew a girl who um, made a potion. There aren't many girl scientists out there. It went wrong and it, and it exploded, and now the whole room is pink. I just gave you guys a really hard and this was a little bit of an experiment, and I wanted to see what you all would draw. What I didn't tell you before is my name is Leah, and I work at King 5, and I'm a scientist. I'm a meteorologist. Do you guys know what that is? I asked you all to draw a picture of a scientist, and that was kind of a trick, because you really can't draw a picture of a scientist, because a scientist can be anyone. When I point to you, I want you to stand up, okay? So how many boys do we have standing? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, congratulations, boys. You're all scientists. How many girls should we have stand up? What would be fair? Five. Ten. ten. One, two. Do you want to stand up? Three. And the glasses, do you want to stand up? Four. Do you want to stand up? Five. Okay, we're done. That's it. Girls versus boys there are working in science, technology, engineering, and math these days. Is that fair? No! How many more girls should we invite to stand up for it to be fair? Okay, stand up for me. One, two, three. Stand up, yeah. Do you want to stand up? And then do you want to stand up? Four, five. Okay, now we have 10 girls and we have 10 boys standing. Is this better? Yes! I learned what I learned today. The world has the same amount of boys and girls. Like, it's equal. It's unfair, maybe, like, uh, we should make a law where, like, all girls can do stuff. Just like Martin Luther King Jr., we can give a big speech out that girls and boys should be allowed to do every job they want. I think that it's important that they know that the world is out there and that they can do whatever they want. I think it's a really interesting opportunity now to go back and talk to them even further as a class to just really think about why is it that you chose to draw a boy or girl and just help launch that conversation. Because like, we need an equality. Would you ever want to be a scientist? Yes. Why is that? Um, because then more girls would probably want to be scientists too. I want to try to be a scientist so it can help the population of girl scientists. So, so maybe it can inspire other young, young girls to, to think, wow, you can, wow, girls and boys can be scientists.